The cyber threat investigation workflow that follows is based on how several of our most successful deployments are using our system. In this demonstration, we'll show how a security team at a large enterprise can use Scrutinizer to rapidly investigate an alarm using NetFlow in combination with additional context from other data systems. The tech will demonstrate how the system can be used to navigate down to the origin of the reported threat. Oftentimes, the threat investigator is alerted by Scrutinizer by email or text message about an employee using a forbidden application like Tor to download content. After expanding on the alarm, the host that triggered the event is made clear. By drilling in on the event, we can see the individual events triggered by the host that caused the alarm. Knowing only the IP address of the host involved is not enough information to resolve the event quickly. By using Scrutinizer, we can determine the username because the system integrates with most network authentication systems such as Microsoft Active Directory, Cisco ICE, Forescouts Counteract, Radius, and more. By clicking the menu icon, we can run additional reports and even run a third-party application. The default report is run in order to observe the traffic back and forth between the hosts involved and changing the time frame is easy. Just go up to the menu icon and change the time frame down here at the bottom and then click apply. And narrowing in on a time frame is even easier. Just click and drag the mouse to zoom in. Now to gain additional information Scrutinizer integrates with IPAN or any other third-party application to display additional context about the host such as the IP group the host belongs to. The tech can drill in on the group to see the other members. If we go back to the default report, the analyst can click on the destination host and run a search to find out if any other internal systems have been communicating with the same destination. You can specify how you want to find the device, where you want to look, and if necessary modify the time frame. Click search. And now the tech can see that there's another host on the DMZ communicating with the same internet host. We can click on the new host and run a partner report to find out a bit more about the IP address in question. Back in the report, our customers find that adding filters is easy. Simply grab any variable, drag it to the left, and either include it or exclude it as a filter. Then click to apply your changes. We can also change the display graphic to provide a better visual on the relationships between hosts. If we change the filter and modify the settings, you can see that the matrix allows security teams and large enterprises to gain a full perspective on the scale of the relationships between all of the hosts involved with the incident. Beyond responding to infections and investigating traffic patterns, Scrutinizer's flow analytics can be used to uncover unwanted behaviors. Custom monitors that monitor for additional unique behaviors can also be added. Triggered events will end up in the alarms table where the IP address can be mapped to a username as well as an IP group. The system keeps count of the violations per host and each algorithm, if desired, can carry a unique weight depending on its severity. The threat index is a multiplier that uses the weight of each event times the number of occurrences. If the threat index reaches a definable threshold, a notification can be triggered and threats can be automatically mitigated as well. Scrutinizer is a massively scalable distributed flow collection system capable of receiving millions of flows per second Contact Plixer today and share with us the unique problems you are trying to solve with flow data.